Good morning, good morning. This is check day one. Well, I, that's not true. Check day three here at uh, one of our properties. Had to had anything getting in here. So, uh, but we got something this morning. Not really what we want, but we still stink up the place. Maybe we'll, uh, decent sized coon there. Caught quite a few coons on here already, so. We'll get him took care of and get that remade. Uh, <laughs> Duke number three caught him by the back foot, so that's pretty funny. Uh, he's actually, that might be a thing, that might be a sow. Mm -hmm. It might be a sow, not tore up on the back or anything, so that'd be, that'd be nice. Uh, but yeah, we'll, uh, nice little catch there. We'll get this one remade and hopefully a cat or a dog will come through here since we got a lot of sign going right between these uh, field changes here. So anyway, and then we'll check day one on the new spot. So as soon as we leave here, we're heading north going to, to one of our turkey places that we put a bunch of sets in yesterday. So hopefully. All right, we'll, we'll show them to you. That's kind of a cool catch here. I actually got him two feet opposite sides, which is kind of interesting. Uh, he's a nice size boar coon and he's not not uh he's not rubbed or anything so be nice nice 2x coon maybe brandon uh, decided to sleep in before he went to work today so we got the squirrel killer himself tyler so uh all right we're gonna get him out of here get this remade and then we'll head north see if we got anything in the first day checks looks like it's gonna be a good morning Coon number two right here. Another little guy. Same spot, but hey, I don't care. Like I told you, my landowner is trying to get his quail population up, so that's an egg eater. Little guy. That's all right. Probably a 10 pounder, maybe a little less. That's all right. He got greedy. We'll take him out. One oh yeah. That's what we're doing. We're gonna get it reset. Then we'll head north. All right guys, we're back to the spot we set out yesterday, the chicken coop for turkeys. And uh, I know we got some catches in here. No canines, that's the upsetting part, but so we're just gonna walk this real quick. Got one there. Ugh. Well, that's unfortunate. Four more empty ones. Hmm. That's weird. Well, I'll check this blind set over here. See if we have something in that. Nope. Nothing hit that one. Let's check the other blind set, I guess. show you when we get over there. Guys, I don't know if you can see that. One of the other blind sets. Skunk number seven for the year. We'll dispatch him first, how about it? <laughs> Gotta get over there quiet like and try to get him took care of. This is a predicament. Well, guys, with all the dog proofs that we put in this area, I thought we'd have more. But we only got one. And that skunk up there, which I just dispatched. So, give him a minute to air out. So, uh, we'll see. I'm going to put some... I forgot the cat food yesterday. So, 
it was just Trapper J's. So we're going to put cat food in there. It's, it's cheaper, it's easier to throw in there, cover up the trigger a little bit, and then put some Trapper J lure in there to give it a good meaty smell. That's a pretty good size coon. These boars are, I assume it's a boar. They're starting to lose weight a little bit from running and breeding so hard, so. Well, we're gonna get him took care of and get him reached. Well, he's just gonna climb that tree, isn't he? He's just gonna climb right up there. But uh, yeah, we'll get him took care of and hopefully we can get a look at that skunk. He was a pretty small skunk, but uh, yeah. We'll rebate these and then we'll show you this coon. Well, I think we're done for the day. No canines, that's all right. It, it's to be expected. Uh, first day checks. There was a few smaller tracks and other things messing around with them, um, but that's why I run about three pounds of paying attention so that doesn't, so I don't catch those things. Uh, but yeah, here's our catch for the day. Bunch of coons, all boars, kind of shed and skunky over there. Oh, small skunk. He sprayed a little bit. To me, it's not that bad, but to this guy who doesn't catch skunks, it's pretty bad to him. But I know when they spray, and I don't think he sprayed that bad. So this one's chewed up pretty good. That's a younger one. But they're all about the same size. These, these boars are wearing themselves down. So anyway, guys, that's, uh, that's the catch today. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to head out of here. I don't know, maybe go to Shields, buy more traps or something. I don't know, maybe, maybe it's not. Never a bad decision. It's never a bad decision to go to Shields because then you go to the big city and then you can get Chick-fil-A, so. Uh, but anyway, guys, Plains and Outdoors, stick with us for the rest of this last two raw for the trapping season. Check day one. See you guys. What's up, everybody? Uh, I've got a 220 right here. the best crossing there's so many smaller crossings through here that it's just kind of hard to like pick one to put a snare on or something well we've got some another property over here going to the rock quarry another place for turkey hunt i've never seen one of these in a 220 before but uh go for the left you guys see that in there it's hard to show you there we go. A dog in a 220. A smaller dog. Hey, that's a coyote though, in a 220. <laughs> that's crazy. I can't believe that. How did he not? I mean, that's just staked in the ground. Well, there's a two foot T stake. That's crazy. <laughs> hey, I'll catch him any way we can get him. <laughs> Okay, well, we'll get that dog took care of and we'll show him to the, you. Here's that coyote in a 220. I don't know how he's not expired. Probably because it's a 220, but uh, we'll get him took care of here. All right, guys, we'll that's a bigger dog than I thought, actually. Sorry for the wind. Here you go. Well, uh, not a huge dog, but size male and the color on him is for southeast nebraska that's pretty good guys. yeah nice white belly <laughs> in a 220 of all things all right guys there's the final catch for the day skunk, four coons, and a coyote. A nice male southeastern Nebraska coyote. A pretty good example of one too. He ain't rubbed or nothing. So yeah, pretty pumped. A good way to end the day. I had this 220 sitting right here, this little crossing. I thought, yo, coon, skunk, maybe a cat, you know. And nope, I thought I was like, well, we gotta check that 220 and we'll get out of here. There's a dog in it. <laughs>
<laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> well, guys, check day one. It was, a, it was a successful day. So, yeah, hopefully tomorrow we'll have more fur. We're going to be, just like I said, it's the last draw for February. So, we're going to trap for probably six, seven more days. So, wish us luck. Actually, wish us good weather. That's the calling for snow this week hopefully that's not true hopefully yeah hopefully no snow because that's worse i can handle rain it's snow that's not fun because you gotta i gotta go and cover all those trees but anyway guys we're gonna keep trapping planes without doors see ya